Hello, anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Final Fantasy VII. Uh, in the last episode, we wandered around for a while trying to find Eris' house. Eventually, we found Eris' house, and not much else happened. Uh, Marlene and Barrett reunited. Uh, I started to slightly get my big black man voice back, so that's good news. And, uh,. Now we have to go and stop Shinra, I guess, and rescue Eris. That's basically, yeah, not a very specific plan. Don't know how our heroes expect to do that. Can't exactly just walk through the front door of Shinra and say, Give us Eris back. She's our waifu. Please. But, hey, it's, it's a goal at least. And you know what all the smart, responsible people say? Who needs plans in life when you've got goals? Yeah. I suppose that's where the trope of the wise old homeless person comes from. <coughs> oh god, I can't breathe. Don't know why. Alright. So we had to come up here to Wall Market of reasons because uh, apparently they think we can find something here to help us uh, get up to Shinra want to see something awesome follow me Woo! okay sure I guess we'll just follow these random kids hey what's going on here everyone climbed up this wire looks scary Brr. can we climb it yeah it leads to the upper world Wow! All right, we'll climb the wire. There's, there's no way we can do this. You know how far it goes up. There is a way. Look, what's that look like? Just a normal wire. Oh yeah? Well, to me, it looks like a golden shiny wire of hope. It's clearly not gold colored, Barrett. It's black. Sorry, it's not gold. You're colorblind. You're right. This is the only way to save Eris. Okay, that was a bad analogy, but Barrett, I understand how you feel. Wasn't even an analogy, man. Let's go. <sighs> I love the music that kicks in. Triumphant, exciting music. How did anybody do their graffiti this far up? Do you guys have a really tall ladder? Oh man, this is horrible. Hey, scary, huh? Dad told me that's the Shinra doing. Shinra's doing. Oh, they're looking at the the tragedy that was Sector 7. Cool. Well, not cool, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean, people. Jeez. Oh. Okay, then we have to jump over there, don't we? No? Okay. How, how do I get over there, then? Oh! Here, apparently. Somehow. Maybe if I put a battery in, the propeller might work. Um, okay. Where would I get a battery? Um, I think there's something shiny in that hole, maybe? No? Okay. Well, this isn't gonna help. This is back down the way we came. Do I have a battery? I don't have a battery on me, do I? Items. Be key items. Wig, sexy cologne, lingerie, silk dress, diamond tiara, member's card. Hmm. Hmm. Dude, that, that'd have to be a pretty big battery, too. Alright, well... Let's try. One up here. No, can't go anywhere there. It might work if I put Yeah, I know. Shut up, Bob. Jeez. Alright, how about... Alright, we can't go any farther over there. Can't go over there. No, okay, I guess... We're not getting a battery in this place. 
something around there. I guess it's my imagination that there's something glowing in the hole. Whatever. Alright, let's climb back down. Let's see if somebody in Walmart has a battery. Maybe that's the, uh... Maybe that's the... the way we gotta do this. Get the battery to make the propeller turn so it'll... I don't know... Shred everything up. Break it all apart. And somehow that'll let us through. Doesn't make any sense to me, but hey... 90s video game logic. That's what puzzles were like back then. Is this pile of trash getting bigger? Yes, I think so. A lot of things came falling down when the Sector 7 pillar fell. Right, right, you're right. The owner of the weapon shop scavenged all the stuff when it came falling down. Oh, is that why? He seems pretty suspicious these days. Oh, you mean he went out to the plate, uh, cross-section next to the Don's mansion, right? Oh, you know. Oh, you know. I wonder what he's doing. Yeah, it gives me the chills. Plate cross section next to the Don's mansion. So how is it? Oh, is that just the place with the wire that we just came from? Sounds like it would be. All right, let's go in here. Maybe, maybe he salvaged a battery. A thrill rod, metal knuckle, assault gun, Titan bangle. Assault gun. That's what the one he already has. Mithril armlet. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <coughs> <coughs> she already has a mithril rod, too. Great. Okay. Don't need that, then. Oh, no. Is this going to be another episode of me running around looking for shit? Uh-oh. Alright, we need to find a battery. Let's just check every building. Highly doubt this building will have a battery, but hey, you never know. Alright. Alright, checked in there. <sighs> I believe that weapon shop was the one with the tank in it. And so we've already been in there, and that guy was the one who's salvaging stuff, and he didn't seem very talkative. Tank, if you're strong enough, anyone can make it to the top plate. So, build your strength by having a plate of our food. Sure. That was scary. Yep. Never believed that Sector 7 would ever come down. Welcome, sit wherever you like. No thanks. I don't believe you serve batteries as, as food at your place. What about you? Fire, lightning, restore, cover. Nope. Okay, maybe sh should I get a second restore? Just in case. Cause then I could have multiple members of the party be able to heal. That would actually be really useful, I think. We'll uh, equip that on somebody in a moment. First, let's run down here. Yeah. Don't suppose any of you have a battery. Hey, it's you. Sorry, but I already heard about you. In addition to dressing like a woman, it seems you like to smash and grind things. What? We only let cultured customers in. Got it? Then you'd better leave. I'm trying to talk to the dude with the red hair, not you, dude. Hey, it's... Oh, that is the dude with the red hair. I thought... What? Why would you... Never mind. Whatever. Screw you, people. Probably don't have batteries anyway. Hey, y'all. Please stay here. Do you have a battery? No. Of course not. Awesome. But, no, I, I didn't talk to you. Leave me alone. Maybe in here... No, that's just the stupid machine gun thing. It's useless to us. Came down from the sky, but the old guy who likes tanks took all of it away. I wanted some too. So it is the guy with the weapon shop with the tank. Everybody keeps talking about him, saying he took all the stuff that fell down. Hmm. Can we talk to him? Oh yeah. You going up to the plate? You better have batteries. Gonna sell some? You're gonna sell me something you just found? Hey, you knew? I repaired them, so it's all right. Why do I need batteries to climb up to the plate? <clears throat> I'll find out when you get there. How about 100 gil for each? <clears throat> all right, I'll take them. Yep, we already need them, so we already know why. Because there's a propeller thing in the way. Yeah, I didn't think you could actually talk to him though through the uh, through the gate, just because he was far away. I Kind of assumed it wasn't possible, so that's why I didn't try it the first time. Oh darn. Oh well. 
Just listen to the uh, triumphant music for climbing. And let it just wash your, your worries away. Get running. And down there. Awesome. Yep, yep. Come on down. Might work if I put a battery in it. Yep. That's what I'm trying to do, Cloud. I guess I'll just have to believe the shopkeeper. <coughs> that is a big ass battery. Okay. Oh, it's spinning alright. Let me guess, it's just gonna stop with the one that's broken facing towards the thing. Or close enough. Like that. Okay. Now what? Let, oh my god, let me over. Let me jump over. Fucking dang. Oh, I probably don't have to climb up there at all. I probably have to get up. Yeah, up here. Alright. Alright, that makes more sense, I guess. Not really, it doesn't actually make any sense, but... Oh shit, we have to take the battery out. <coughs> okay, oh, oh, no. Over there. Back over there. What are you doing? Get over there, damn it. Alright, can we jump across over here, maybe? Need a battery here, too. Oh! So he just gave us a whole shit ton of batteries. Is that it? Okay. Sure. And... Looks like the only way is to jump onto that bar! Should make it if I jump before it comes too close. He's okay to jump. Oh my god. I jumped too soon. You said before it comes too close. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. Stop talking, Cloud. Alright, thank you. Awesome. None of this makes any sense. These things look far too slippery for him to climb on. Oh well. Yeah, there's another thing for a battery. Well, I guess... I guess he gave us like a... I mean, these batteries are fucking huge. They're bigger than Cloud's own head. I can't climb down there? Why not? What the hell? I have to... Oh, I have to climb up over the wire and then climb down this one. Alright, fine. Need a battery here, too. Received ether. Oh. Great. Oh, no. Now we have to do the jump again, don't we? Oh, no. I think we're good. Or not? The hell? Let me jump down somewhere. Damn thing. Alright. Let's try going back up here. That was kind of pointless to let us go down there. Can I jump across over there? Nope. Oh. Alright, down this side. <laughs> Jeez! So finicky, game! Alright, yep, 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 stop. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Jeez. Who thought this was a good idea? Having just a random, weird platforming segment in this RPG? Alright, yep, no, yep, climb down over there. He wasn't even walking on anything there. Doesn't matter, though, I guess. Okay. Down here? That... just... leads to a dead end? Oh, up... Oh, okay, okay, fine. Up the pipe, then. Alright, go ahead. Hey, look! It's the Shinra! The Shinra! Despite the fact that it's a... company and not a singular thing. And just one person who's all of Shinra or anything. It kind of doesn't make any sense grammatically to call it the Shinra over and over again, but that's what they keep calling it, so that's what I'll call it too, I guess, since they, Hey, I didn't notice Cloud ever had those weird holes in his sword. 
You can see it right there on the, the, the model for his sword. He has like two holes in it on the bottom there. <coughs> hey, you ought to know this building well. No, not really, now I think about it. This is the first time I've ever been to the headquarters. I heard about this place before. Every floor above the 60th is special and not easy to get to, even for employees. Must be where they took errors. Security is pretty light now. All right, let's go. Wait a second. You're not thinking of just going right through the main entrance, are you? Well, what else does it look like? I'm gonna kick some Shinra butt and... That's not going to work. We've got to find another way. Ain't gonna be no other way. If we keep wasting time like this, errors will... I know that, but if we get caught here... Hey, Cloud, what should we do? Let's bust on in. Let's sneak in quietly. Like a smart person. See? Let's be careful and find a different route. Yeah. After we save our game. I think if we... I don't remember if uh, fucking up the stealth bit just means having to restart at a checkpoint or save slot or if you just get into a fight. I don't know. <laughs> oh, jeez. Excuse me. <clears throat> hey, look at that. We literally just had to walk like 20 feet to the left and we found another entrance. Yeah, oh, hey, stop skipping. We look, oh my god, all out of the way. I don't have time to argue with you. Yo, Tifa, don't go alone. Jeez, you people. I wanted to read those and you wouldn't go and friggin' force the dialogue to skip. Not cool, game. Not cool. Oy vey. Up the longest flight of stairs in the world, apparently. Oh boy. Wow, it just keeps going and going and going. Don't know why the hell we gotta climb. Cause we don't wanna start a commotion till we've saved Eris, if that's possible. <clears throat> Knock it off, you're giving me the creeps. What? Why would he laugh like that? In that creepy way. So even you will fight for someone else. Guess I figured you wrong. Who cares what you figured? I'm just saying, maybe I was wrong. They're just repeating the same section of stairs over and over again. It's the same pre-rendered background, so all the like boxes and trash and everything are in the exact same places. It's kind of funny, actually be able to notice it so easily. How much farther do these stairs go on? Why don't you ask them? Oh, sick burn, Tifa. It's not one of them endless stairways or something, is it? Of course not. Ha! We've now passed Barrett. Right. Couldn't be that. Because those don't exist. Jeez, Barrett. Jeez. Oh, look! I'll pass both of them. They're both just... Oh, no, they somehow skipped ahead. Are we there yet? Not yet. Ooh. There yet? I said not yet. Jeez, Barrett. Yo. Look, don't even ask. We're way, 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 way too far. Blah, 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 something. I don't know. Hey, potion? Elixir. Even better. Hell yeah. Oh no, where'd they go? Damn, man, I've had it. I'm going back. It'll take just as long to go down as it did to come up. Wow, Barrett. Wow. Not the brightest bulb ever, are you? And for some reason, very unfit, despite your massive size and muscles. Come on, Barrett, pull it together. Yeah, well, all I know is I'm only flesh and blood, except for this arm of mine. Don't treat me like I'm some ex-soldier or something. <clears throat> what about me? I'm human too. Oh, do what you want. I'm going on. Maybe Tifa just has a better cardio workout than him or something. Yeah, Barrett, you go first. Oh, yeah! Barrett, you go first. Are you kidding me? What are you, ignorant? I didn't mean that. <clears throat> alright, alright. It's not even, it's not a ladder or something. This is, this is such a 
weird, random, pointless thing. It's kind of typical of Japanese. Whenever there's like a situation, like, like Japanese games and anime and stuff, whenever there's a situation where a woman wearing a skirt, even a long skirt, is like in a situation where she might be above people, she always gets incredibly worried that people will look up her skirt. And that's such like a weird random thing to fit in here. Cause it's like that would only ever even work on a ladder. You're on stairs. The stairs aren't steep enough. P somebody following you up the stairs couldn't just look up and see under under your stupid skirt. <sighs> Whatever. Cloud, you go on ahead too. Yeah. Sh so you weren't worried the whole rest of the time when Cloud was behind all of you guys. Yo, what floor is this? <clears throat> I stopped counting. Why they gotta build these damn buildings so tall? That Shinra, they're just no damn good. Yeah, how dare they build tall buildings? That's evil. Damn them. Killing people is one thing, but building tall buildings is, is just a whole other issue. To force you to have to walk up all these stairs. Oh, man, I'm beat. Marlene, Daddy wanted to see your face one more time. Would you stop acting like a retard and climb? <laughs> it's just a bit more. <clears throat> oh my god, I love this. Maybe. Oh, I love that she just called him a retard. That is funny. I don't remember a lot of stuff about this game, apparently. <laughs> I didn't remember the having a child serving drinks at a bar. I didn't remember the actual use of swear words. I didn't remember them using terms like retard. That's awesome. <clears throat> Finally, made it. Ever want to see? No more stairs the rest of my life. Huff puff, I'm beat. But here we are, we better get ready. Better get ready? Jeez. I just realized if I die and have to reload that save point, I'm gonna have to, like, s go all the way up those stairs again. That'd be awful. Oh, nope, those are guards. We don't want to go there. <coughs> Alright, let's try to look around, though. Okay, they are blocking those elevators, so let's go to these ones. If they're working. Hey, Cloud! come this far and you're thinking of going back down to the first floor? No! Yeah, that's right, let's go on! What about this one? Is this one different? Hey, Cloud, we come this far and think about a No! Alright, I guess we have to go towards the enemies then. Destroy the intruders! Oh, those aren't the people we just saw. Literally not at all the people we just saw. Oh, hey, they're robots in armor. But seriously, it was, uh... It was just, like, regular dudes standing in front of those elevator doors before. Big shot. Use it on him. He's still at full health. I don't know how much damage your big shot will do. Probably quite a bit. Maybe enough to break his armor off? Yeah! Awesome. Oh, Cloud, how could you miss? Cloud, I had... more hope for you than that. Jeez, man. Oh, well. There you go. Another one loses his armor, and another one dead? Yeah! No, anyway, the other guy didn't lose his armor, damn you! You're supposed to lose your armor because Barrett shot you like at least twice now. All right, there, fine. Awesome. Yeah, these guys weren't so tough. Not such a big deal. All right, let's. Uh... Oh, Cloud, why are you taking the knee? What's this? Receive key item, key card 60. Wow. Oh man. All right, let's do some potions on the whole team. Okay, not Barrett, because he's still near full health. Never mind. 
not quite the full team. Just most of the... Just two-thirds of the full team. Floor... 60, I guess? No reason to bother with 59. Oh, wait, I think we were just... I think we just came from 59, actually. Never mind. That's why it even bothers to list it. Well, this is pleasant. So you guys come here often? Okay. I guess not. Hmm. Gotta say, I'm a little disappointed that there's no uh, elevator music. I guess the uh, I guess the higher up Shinra employees don't uh, don't really appreciate you know good music. Because I mean, why else would they not ask their their manager to install some elevator music? Okay, I guess you guys don't care. I mean, I just think every elevator could be approved with a bit of, you know, pleasant classical music or something, and it's, you know, uh, you know, Shinra has the money, I'm sure they could dig up some classical music from some place, I mean, it's, it's not like Midgar's completely devoid of culture, right? You guys, you guys don't think so? Wow, this is going on for really long. This is, uh, this is longer than I thought it was going to take to get up one floor. Because we were on we were on 59. If, uh, assuming I'm, I was correct, I believe we were on floor 59. But it's taking a really long time to go up to floor 60. And uh, we couldn't have been on floor 1, which could explain why it's taking so long. But, you know... Because when we were in the lobby, we uh, tried to go to that other door uh, that was up at the top left corner. That uh, that took us to, you know, an elevator, but that would have gone down to floor one. And you guys stopped me from doing that, from making that mistake, which I, I thank you for. But, uh, you know, I think that uh, thoroughly proves that we could not have been on floor one or anywhere close to it. So, yeah, so. so it's a little weird that... Uh, it's just taking so long. I hope Eris is alright. Oh, do I have to actually talk to them to continue the scene? This is the real thing. Don't let your guard down. Oh my god, no wonder it was taking so long. The game was waiting for me to talk to both of them. Jesus. <laughs> Longest ele elevator ride in existence. And it's all my fault. Uh oh. The hell are those? Those look weird. Okay, can we sneak over here and do something uh, else? Maybe? No? <sighs> hey, look! A door! We can get around them. Super easy, right? Can we, uh, finagle with any of these computers to make stuff happen? Look at all them guards running around! <coughs> Cloud, you go on ahead and signal us when it's safe to move. Oh boy. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's wait until they walk off to the right, because I think we have to hide behind the pillars or something. Like those golden pillars. Okay, yeah. Just try to wait until they go off to the right a bit. I think it's only safe to move. Fuck! Hey there, what do you think you're doing here? God damn it. I messed. I, I specifically remember messing up that section when I played this game the first time as well. That was stupid. Alright, Tifa's attack you, I guess. Cloud attack you, I guess. Bear attack you, same dude, I guess. Ah, <sighs> we all just. Focus on the one. There's no advantage to be gained by Bear attacking any of them for being in the back row. So. 
Hey, cool. Can you guys knock down his armor, please? No, okay, fine. Cloud defend. Hmm. <clears throat> Good. You know what, actually... Yeah, oh, he's dead anyway. Good. Good job, Tifa. He managed to do really good damage that time. For once in your life. What the hell are you doing? Man, you gotta do it again. Oh, God, no. Alright. Okay, so I think... Okay, yeah, as long as we're... Wait for the soldiers to turn, then push OK to signal the others. Oh my god. Okay. Wow, I don't like this section. Okay. Great. Awesome. And these other guys are moving even faster, so this is going to be a bit harder. Just amazing. Just absolutely amazing. This is this is what I love in my RPGs. Stealth sections that are really hard because they have really strict rules. Oh, what? I'm not trying to hide behind here. I was trying to go in the door. I guess I just... I, I, guess I just pressed the button straight to the right. Oh, no! I didn't realize this is... God, it didn't pop up with a stupid fucking message. I thought it was going to wait until I got to the other door to have me signal them across. Yeah, yeah attack from both sides. What the fuck a doodle do? You attack the other one on the other side. Or attack this one. Awesome. Great. Wow, the guy's armor didn't even get taken off. That's just amazing. Alright. Well, um... Sure, whatever. Maybe she'll kill him in one hit, despite the fact that he has his armor on? Maybe. Yeah, cool. Hey, good job, Tifa. Well, it's good to know at least that those guys don't have just, like, arbitrary... The hell are you doing, man? You got to... God, you have to do this again until I complete it? Ah, oh, shit, and I'm out of time for this episode, so we'll have to continue it again when we come back. I hope you've all enjoyed this, and I'll see y'all next time, where hopefully we won't fuck up the stealth section. Buh bye bye <laughs>